Now, it's been well documented how so many of our smartphones and other gadgets are manufactured in China these days. But what about Vietnam? It's emerging as an alternative to China with its tax incentives and cheaper workforce. Scott Heidler reports now from Hanoi. Just 20 years ago, most Vietnamese earned their living from the land. But now, manufacturing has taken over agriculture. This land north of Hanoi used to grow tea. Just a small patch of plantation remains. Now, smartphones roll out by the millions. This is the growing manufacturing complex built by Samsung, the world's largest maker of smartphones last year. The company has already invested over $10 billion in Vietnam, and it's expanding. It employs 50,000 people. With a plentiful workforce, the government opened its doors to high-tech companies, looking to bring them from China, where a worker's average salary is three times that of Vietnam. The cost of doing business in China now increased very uh, uh, fast. So. In that sense, uh, we try to uh, have a better policy to attract the uh, DNC transnational company. And that policy came in the form of big tax breaks. Samsung won't pay any for the first four years. But Vietnam's move to become the global smartphone hub is not limited to huge multinationals moving here. One local manufacturer is jumping into the game, making their own smartphone. BKAV will unveil its B phone in the coming months. The company sees industry leaders like Samsung setting up here as helpful to its business. With the massive Samsung factory in Vietnam, it's an advantage for companies starting to make smartphones here. When they came, the supply companies for parts came too. And that helps BKAV gain access to the same components as the top companies in the industry. And it will keep smartphone manufacturing costs down in Vietnam, enticing further investment. As we all know, price of the smartphone is continue going to be dropped. So um, it keeps pressure on the manufacturing company to find location or find way to keep the cost low. Other big manufacturers see Vietnam as a good option too. LG and Microsoft are also expanding here. With the ground in Vietnam so fertile for high-tech growth, soon there will probably be even fewer people working the fields and more punching the factory time clock.